collaborating to make a miniature scarf. I start by cutting a piece of fabric that's long enough to wrap around the doll's neck with extra about this much. I also cut it thicker than it needs to be so I can fold over the sides and sew them. Mine is about a foot by two inches. I just want a long scarf though. Fold over the side and sew along that side. I do the same thing on the other side. Bottoms. This part is optional, but I want to add a couple threads coming down from the bottom. So I take yarn. It can be matching it or it can be a different color, whichever look you want to go for. I turn onto the bad side. I take little snippets of yarn and then glue it to the back with fabric glue. Once the glue is dry, I cut it to my, the desired length to make a scarf. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and tell us what you thought and what kind of videos you want to see. Also follow us on Instagram and check out our Etsy. See you next time! Here we go. I'm all set to wrap this gift to send to my friend Tessa, who lives in Texas. Ugh, the wrapping paper. How could I forget that? Hmm. Something long that can muffle the screams. Perfect! Oh, Magna! What is it, Icicle? Jimmy Stringer is sucking the power out of Vepper again! What? Ah! Mm. Ah! Uh. Huh? Why can't I move? Because you're tied up, idiot! Because you're not the brightest knife in the box! Oh, right. No! <clears throat> Where does Stormer keep the hero pod? Why would I tell you? I'll do this. Ah! I'll ask you again. Where does Stormer keep the hero pod? I'm not telling you. Oh! <laughs> Time to read the war torch. What the? I knew it. Whenever anything goes missing, it's Icicle. Let me pull the scarf off you. Don't pull! I'm so sorry, Magna! Good job, Rhonda! I was gonna do that! Bye, Magna. Bye. Wait a minute. Magna's not contained anymore! Icicle!